Vector be jamming, SPL be chilling, and Charmy be busting through the door. <laughs> Open up the box and out pops up a walkie-talkie and a client who says he's got a job for them. And judging by the dollar signs in her eyes, it's a lot of cash. SPO then goes Obi-Wan on the saying, I've got a bad feeling about this, and then Vector points out their policy. We never turn down work that pays! Off they go to Seaside Hill, where their first mission is to collect 10 hermit crabs. Okay, seems a bit pointless, but okay. Hey Vector, uh, any chance you could teach me how to make a bubblegum bubble like that? I am a robot bird, I am here to prove my human shields. Once the Icock is defeated, the team heads over to Grandmetropolis, where their next task is to destroy all the robots occupying the city. Then they go and fight Team Dark. Charmy, this isn't a game for you. You're too young to gamble. Oh, that's the, that's, that's, that's the job you want them to do? All right, have at it, Charmy. My ears! I am the egg of a trust. My design is lazy. Vector is all like, Hey, that egg man is a fake! And the clients are like, Gee, I think! The team talks for a minute to figure out their client's true identity. And I think Vector is starting to get a few ideas. After fighting Team Rose in Frog Force, the team finds the mustache moron in Mystic Mansion. Now Vector knows who their client is. I am the Egg Emperor. I am not really an Emperor. Eggman dies. Or does he? It turns out their client is none other than Dr. Eggman. Who saw that coming, huh? Oh, who am I kidding? We all knew it was Eggman. This ends the chaotic story. But just when you think it's all over, that's when the final boss shows up. Oh, we're